Hi guys, welcome to another Magic Merge tutorial. Um, this one is for Skeletal Mesh Merging. Um, so there's other mergers on the marketplace, but this one has an advantage that they don't in that it will keep morph targets if they're present. Uh, it's editor only for that. There is a runtime node, but the runtime node cannot keep morph targets in a packaged game. But in editor, uh, there's a, uh, I'll show you how it works. Um, just pick the meshes you want. Uh, magic merge, merge skeletal meshes, and here are all the meshes you merge. You can add more here if you didn't have them all selected. Uh, I'm not going to do that though. Um, I recommend picking the skeleton, um, otherwise it will. Uh, you have to assign it later. So I'm going to pick the skeleton that came with this pack. Actually, uh, there's a full skeleton already. Um, if you don't pick a skeleton, it'll try to auto generate one, um, and then you'll have to pick a, a skeleton after, and it will. Uh, I'll try, I'll try to merge all the bones. Um, but anyway, I'm going to leave everything as default. I'm going to merge the morph targets. We don't have cloth, but I'll leave it checked because it doesn't matter. Uh, just press continue. <clears throat> and it's that easy. It merged the mesh. And also, the original mesh here had, they both had uh, physics assets. And if I look for the physics asset, it also merged the two physics assets together from the body and the arms. Um, so the advantage this has is it, it merges physics assets, um, which also works at runtime, um, and, and it also merges morph targets, which unfortunately is editor only. Um, and it's that simple.